Market Window Smoke being lined up for Miltsy. There are three defenders here for the ninjas. So as they barrel on in, the defense is going to be ready. Yeah, two have pushed up to short there, so they're not going to be on the site as the utility comes through and a smoke has been deployed. Maxter, he's in short there and he's able to get that opening kill under serve, but LNC goes down out. Both these players in towards short and they're just taking the duels. Purdy doubles up. That's Leif Chikidio, who's just stepping in for this roster now instead of Era, so that'll be a talking point to get into. The bomb can go down, but it's an extra amount of advantage here for Ants in the retake. Trying to make it work. There's a smoke and a kit, so the defuse could be possible, but Potty's hitting all of the shots. It's a masterclass from him on this B-bomb site. ZTR is all that remains. It gets cleaned up by Henu. Ents Academy keeping... It doesn't do as much damage as I would have initially anticipated. A lot of mid-presence here. Oh, Chikinio through the smoke's going to find a kill in the server. Giving them the mad advantage here. I see it's an awkward duel, but Chikinio comes out ahead. He's doubled up now in the round. Two openers for young ninjas at the back of the... Fresh player on their team, but there is going to be a chime in from the Desert Eagle. Purdy trying to get two, he does it! Wow, what a shot! Milty also able to find one, and well, the man advantage now back for Ents have opened up this A bomb site completely. Both these CTs rotating in from B, and it's shut out. Really well played from Purdy. Desert Eagle shines and reigns true, and now Milty peering on in, trying to eliminate Maxter. Has spotted him out. Gets supported in by the flashbang, but Maxter isn't peeking. Critical engagement's coming on in. That flashbang, oh, it's so perfect. Milty sprays them down. A hat trick on the site. And Ents, they secure three rounds on the board. B is the inevitable ploy here. And he's playing a bit of utility, firing a few shots, trying to get a bit of info on who's at home. Going to find Maxter, do some damage to him. And now the cavalry is going to arrive. They're going to be storming into the site. Milty and Purdy find one. A piece and server finds one of his own. So Adam B are gonna try and do something with the Deagle, but the Mac 10 long range spray does the job. Much better from its Academy on the anti eco rounds. This time they're using their utility effectively, clearing out all the nooks and crannies with the Molotov. To kind of flushing out that position of that sentry is actually gonna burn him down very low. Almost goes down purely to the incendiary. I'm not even sure they even knew he was there. The smoke faded and they just threw it in. And he's down to five HP. That is unfortunate, is the nade gonna do it? Oh, Jaquinio does it to him with the utility, and now it's gonna be the burst off towards the B site. Utility deployed LNZ. He's tucked in on the top corner here, might not be cleared. A bit of a funky angle to B, and he gets the spray down onto two, gets the third, and the fourth, the transfer from LNZ. That is ludicrous. Double smokes being deployed. That's uh, to counter the window Molotov. Said Young Ninjas deploy one towards top mid, and Jaquinio finds the opener towards ramp. Yeah, now the smoke's going to be coming through, so they are committing to this attack onto the A site, and particularly off that kill there. Jaquinio caught off guard. Molotov out of that really awkward angle with the AWP, but Max is going to double up. Nade and the rifle get it done, putting it into now a three on two. Server, he's on top of stairs in the smoke with the bomb. This could either win or lose the round, and it's going to find a kill. Henry's also found one in towards mid, so now it's just LNZ. One versus two, and Sentry thrown forward, fire at his feet, but he's gonna charge through and find the headshot. Henry reveals himself, but is able to get the kill. Gonna be an attack onto the B bomb site. Utility being deployed by young ninjas as they trickle out here, but a very defensive setup from Ents Academy. Not gonna have anyone on the site. It's gonna allow that bomb to go down. Adam B, he's just continuing to push forward, finds a kill with the Glock. Henry's a little bit stuck in here towards CT. Has some teammates to support. That flashbang's gonna allow the swing out, and US is gonna hit the headshot though. Let's put it back into this 4 and 4 Chikidio is tucked in close and a flash of their own is perfect. Blinds both of them. Henu and Jesse double up. Maxter and ZTR now into this 2 on 4. Smoke gets deployed. Nils is able to find the first, but behind Maxter playing around this smoke does eventually get hunted down. The numbers. That's a P250 there for LNZ. All sitting in this smoke and a single defender in server with an MP9, holding a little bit of an off angle. He's gonna swing out and spot them. They can overwhelm him. There's a bomb site open here. That's the bomb that can go down, plus a MP9 that can be retrieved. Yeah, let's not rule them out just yet. Poddy though rotates in, immediately eliminates Chikinio, that allowed Young Ninja's entryway on towards the bomb site. The bomb plant is good enough, but can they convert the round? You see the Ents reinforcements gathering in, two from Market, one from Short. They attempt to split on him, but Adam B is trying to get closer, but Milty will silence him. And now LNC is all that remains, gets cleaned up by the- Combat with that MP9. 
And the SMG's range advantage here. Yeah. Gonna get him a kill. Can't quite net the second. That's a tiny bit of damage onto LNZ. Let's get the man advantage now for Young Ninjas. They make their way to the A-bomb site. Two players towards Connector and Daz. Henu, you can see he's holding for it. He get flashed off the line, trying to find any head that will protrude and give it to him. The server's nowhere to be found. His flank is going to come in very late. The bomb is only just going down now. The spam comes through the box, but they do get it off. Ran out of bullets. Baxter creeping in towards jungle. Silencer yet to reveal itself in. Miltsy is here to join the party. Chiming in. This smoke allows them a little bit more of a safer passage, but that server flank is eliminated. And ZTR can even do one better. And now Henu is all that remains. And in fact, he's trying to get out of dodge real quick, but his flank it is being held. So even if he gets this kill, which he won. Desert Eagle fan, press 2 in chat if you're a FAMAS fan. Well, you can't compare the Desert Eagle to the FAMAS. Work last round. Oh. oh, okay. Silence then four works in this one. Doesn't even need to see his opponent's Jaquino hits the deck. And now Henu, oh, he's just tip-tapping away. And it's all clean up for Ed's Academy over towards BLNZ with a hand cannon of his own. Let's see how many he can provide. Not enough, just the first. Ed's Academy and now deploy a rifle in between middle and the A bomb site. And currently... A is where young ninjas reside, and Uisi could be the difference maker. Drops a smoke grenade, extinguishes the molly, and finds the opening as well. Position now given up, but it allows Polly to swing on in, but he's getting caught out as well. Henu with a pistol can't get it done, but it will be Milksy rotating away, stealing the AWP, and trying to get out away. But it's still two versus two, Lucy. It's still could happen. Yeah, they can play this one a bit more chill now. They don't have to... Go for these chaotic kills. Smokes are deployed. There's a long flank though. See it on the mini map, ZTR. Oh, He's no. making his way through with this Galil. That's gonna hit the perfect timing to catch both these players off guard. And well, now it's just server. Go for the wall bang here, and there's that flank. It comes through hot and heavy. ZTR finds server, and could be the right call. Just two defenders on this side of the map. Deployed, Miltsy. Oh, gonna find the opening on ZTR. Huge kill. Gonna be making their way onto the site now. Henry gets the first onto Maxter. Server's still here as well. Not checked quite yet. Playing this off angle and gonna be slowed down as Adam B. And that allows him to go down. Purdy on the rotate. Gonna drop the bomb. And before you know it, it's just Akinio left with an AWP. Trying to find some kills. Missed a decent post site position. Yeah, it is, because he can just. Lock them off here, Jaquinio. As they rotate over, there he goes. Plucked out the sky of the first and gets information on the second. Doesn't need to reveal himself. UEC has got to clear his angles. And he does win it out. All the meanwhile, ZTR and Pody. That's now the next fight. But Pody's not revealing himself. He's waiting. Tucked in just for a moment, trying to get UEC just to close the gap. ZTR needs to isolate the kills and he can't do it. And that'll be it. Ents Academy will remain... Victorious over Young Ninjas, 16 to 11. Yeah, what a CT half from